Hey, on this rainy Monday, Sports Live in the ATL, David here. You know, it's proud for, oh, first of all, Road to 3K. If you're new to the channel, click the subscribe button. You're going to be highly entertained. Click the notification bell so you'll see when the content and the games and the videos and the premieres come up. You'll be highly entertained. Click the like button because you will be highly entertained. Click the dislike button. That keeps happening. You clearly are in your feelers and highly entertained. Share it to all your media outlets. So all the sports fans around the world, on the moon, in the universe, in the Milky Way, can be highly entertained. You know, this feels great to be a Falcons fan this week. You might ask yourself, self, what is what is Slitta talking about? The Falcons, three straight playoff, non-playoff seasons, getting swept by the Saints, swept by the Bucks, four and twelve records, six blown leads, Super Bowl chokes. Okay, I just took away all your material. Ringless, ring check. The reason is, is because I'm going to be able to laugh a lot on Sunday. The question is, will it be ha 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 bandwagons or ha 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 I told you, four straight NFC South Division, but don't mean anything, y'all choke in the playoffs, by you breathe. Which ha ha he he is it going to be? What's the decimal level going to be on the game stream? Because one of them are going to lose. So I'm going to make this first one. I made it in general in my premiere earlier. But I'm going to make my first one. Why? Why, why, why? Because since I expect this to happen, why do I want to see the Pudats lose? Again, not Tampa Bay winning. The Pudats lose on Sunday night. Quite simple. I don't like you. I don't like your franchise. I don't like your city. I don't like the seats in that old dirty, broken down, rat infested stadium that I had to sit in my six foot four self. Had a great time at the game though, even though we lost. A lot of respect for the Saints fan treated me with ultimate kindness. Still waiting on my gumbo. They didn't give me any gumbo or boudin or whatever it is that they have there. I had to go to Bourbon Street and get what I had to get in my hotel. But I don't like nothing about you. I almost got pickpocketed outside of that super dumb. I had to tell the Saints fan, excuse me, he got scared, by the way. But I don't want y'all to win because I don't like you. And this is the rivalry. Y'all don't want us to win. I don't like a lot of your annoying fans. And there are a lot of y'all. I already mentioned the ones I respect. I don't need to mention it again. This is not about them. Because if the Falcons would have won the Super Bowl, I know they would have been happy for me. They already congratulated me uh, and con consoled me during that time. They know who they are. They always they they let they they understand the robbery and respect the robbery, and uh, they you know that's what I respect. But there are a lot of you Pudat fans out there who get in your feelers so much. You know when I'm able to get y'all in cam and you don't really do it. When I get y'all to swamp and flood my chat section and post all these memes, I got you in your feelers. So why do I want the Pudats to lose on Sunday against the Bucks in the NFC Divisional? It's purely simple because you will I would rather laugh at y'all over Tampa Bay next weekend or this weekend because Tampa Bay is going to have theirs because I told you not one of y'all were going to uh, uh, go to the Super Bowl and win it so I'm going to laugh my butt off regardless I want to see you Pudat fans who are talking a bunch in my comments all year I want to see y'all cry. I want to see y'all in your feelers because what's going to happen is when y'all lose, all y'all are going to come back and say is, well, we swept y'all. We own y'all. Ring check. 2009, 28-3. Super Bowl choke. Six chokes this year. I mean, what do you got? That's all y'all say to me. But you want to know what? That's all y'all say to me, but I got plenty for y'all. I am so creative, I could come up with something at the snap of a finger. Like, for instance, Pudat fans, get the Get the pillows in the bags because you're going to need them on Sunday when y'all lose in the playoffs for the fourth straight year. And then Drew Brees, who I respect, is going to ride off into the sunset, get those headsets, the clipboard, the pen, and get ready for NBC Sports Sunday night football. Yeah. So y'all's misery is going to be my joy come Sunday night. The stream is going to be lit. 
I don't want to see Pudat fans celebrate a damn thing. Never. And my channel is pretty uh, professional when it comes to sports. But when it comes to this, I got I got to be I got to be the old me. What you see is what you get. What I say is what I mean, and what I mean is exactly what I say. So Pudats, don't blame me for your loss coming Sunday. Don't blame me. Blame your team. Because if it wasn't for 2009 and all those cheap shots that you put on those, those players, Greg Williams, y'all wouldn't have won a damn thing. Pudat fans, y'all think y'all won one Super Bowl and it makes y'all the best thing since sliced bread. No, you know what? You know what teams are better than sliced bread? I hate to say it. The Patriots of the old with Tom Brady, the Steelers, the Cowboys, the 49ers, even though their rings are as old as a spider web on a wall, they're still more relevant than yours. Y'all, the sports guys just didn't like us, and Lady Luck shined down on y'all that day because they wanted to give y'all something. Because once y'all lose on Sunday and Drew Brees bolts, it's going to be the same old poot ass that I remember in the 80s and 90s. The fan base is going to dwindle in half. They're going to take away the bins from the Mercedes sign and make it, I don't know, Mercedes half stadium. I don't know what y'all going to do. The YouTube fans are going to be almost non-existent like bandwagon Falcon fans are non-existent. That's what it's going to be. And if you want to know, and I've said this, your immediate future, future Pudats, look at the Patriots because that is your immediate future. So enjoy this week. Comment all you want because come Sunday, he who laughs last will be laughing best, and that'll be me. Tampa Bay, don't worry, I, I got you covered. I got you covered too. Don't think that I care about y'all, because I don't. I got you. Just do your job. Just, you got one job to do on Sunday, and get it done, or else. And I will see you.